Now, Thai police have fired water cannon, tear gas, and rubber bullets to stop protesters from marching on the office of Prime Minister Prayut Chan Ocha, calling for him to resign. More than 1,000 protesters took part in the demonstration despite an expanded coronavirus lockdown. Demonstrators carried mock body bags to represent coronavirus deaths as they blamed the Prime Minister and his government for mismanaging the COVID-19 pandemic. The use of force by the police came after some protesters tried to dismantle bumped wire and metal barricades set up by the authorities to block roads from the Marcosi Monument to Government House where the Prime Minister works. The protests marked one year since the force of a wave of large-scale street protests led by youth groups that attracted hundreds of thousands of people across the country. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.